What's up, guys? Steve again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24 7. Check out this new one from Teaching. It's another turbo fan engine. It's the DM121. Takes around about two hours from start to finish, over 300 pieces. Now, it gives you a fantastic uh, diagram of you know, how to put everything together. Now, apparently, this engine is in an a, uh, A320, B737, or a C919. Interesting. Shows how to put everything together. It's really easy, and it, it's all in different like assemblies. You've got fan, fan assembly, intermediate castling assembly, gearbox assembly. It's really good. And the majority of these parts are all metal or cast aluminium or I'm not just sure you want to say, but it's pretty intensive and <laughs> they do weigh a fair bit. Now, this actually, this structure manual is pretty good because it tells you if it's your first time doing it, how to put in bearings correctly. I know it sounds simple to people that do it all the time, but it's handy to have that, you know, for example there, you know, how to put in screws correctly. It's simple stuff, but a lot of people might not be the first time, but it's good to know. And, you know, instructions are super easy to follow, clear, in colour, you know, all the parts are kind of using uh, in colour so you can see, you know, so it kind of distinguishes it. Easy, simple stuff. Really, really good. Anyway, so, here's the model itself, and with all these kits, they're built really well. I think they're fantastic. The switch gear and everything it seems good. It's got a little uh, kind of a plate there as well, tells you about the engine. But the whole thing with these in, they're all see-through, Turn it on, and with this one, it's got like a throttle. So you kind of see it ramps up, gives it that kind of effect. So there's it back down. It's got a charging point here as well. See that light lights up when it's charging. But there you go. But the party trick with these is you can see inside it, and that little, you know, it does run smoothly. Just to get the tolerance of the of the graders. It's just some of these internal blades just kind of slapping together. And especially if you shut it off, the front one here. Because it's kind of slotted into this front assembly there. And this nose cone spins on and locks it all together. And that, for example, that's one solid piece of aluminium machined down. So that's cool. So you can turn it on, you can see that kind of awesome effect. There. And on the side, you can see there, that is the gearbox assembly. It's got two, two gears there running around. That one runs into the gearbox inside the turn, actually, the turbine. And this motor here, this is the motor itself. There's a small gearbox with about three gears to, to uh, move the power up there. That's it. So this side is all some fuel line there. This one's obviously all in case you can't see through, but the main side, you can see through and see everything working. There you go. Really nice stuff. Simple to build and quite enjoyable as well. Only thing that might get a little bit frustrating is all the little nuts here, but that's part of the part and parcel of building, I guess. I really enjoy these. Uh, links down below if you want to go check it out. Quick video. Yeah, not much else to say, but definitely if you're an aviation buff, you'd love these. Or anyone, you know, the STEM kind of education, it's fantastic as well. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Have a good one, and I'll see you next time.